My grocery store has a rewards program. Maybe some of the stores you shop have that. It seems like everybody's having some kind of a rewards program. Well, at the store I shop at, the more groceries you buy, the more points you receive, and you can use those points to get cheaper prices at their gas station, anywhere from 10 cents to a dollar off the price of gasoline. So it's a pretty cool program. It's, it's nice to have some rewards. And I got to thinking about that a little bit, since we all like rewards. God doesn't leave us out when it comes to his reward program either. In fact, he tells us pretty plainly over in the book of Luke, Luke chapter uh, 18, verse 29. Here's what he says about his rewards program. Christ says, Assuredly, I say to you, there is no one who has left house or parents or brothers or wife or children for the sake of the kingdom of God, who shall not receive many times more in this present time and in the age to come, eternal life. So that's a whole lot better than a couple of pennies off gasoline. God's reward program says there's blessings right now. Now, he's not talking about bigger cars or better houses or more money. He's not talking about physical things or health or things like that. He's talking spiritual blessings he offers in his reward program right now today. And he also says there's big rewards tomorrow as well. Beyond today, there's rewards of eternal life as his children in the kingdom forever. Now, talk about a great rewards program. That's the one we want to be a part of. In fact, some of the rewards programs, they're called loyalty programs. God's program requires loyalty as well. Another passage is found in 2 Peter. If you look at 2 Peter chapter 1, beginning in verse 10, Peter makes it clear, God's loyal to us. We need to be loyal in our life to Him. He says, Brethren, be even more diligent to make your call and election sure. For if you do these things, you'll never stumble. For so an entrance will be supplied to you abundantly into the everlasting kingdom of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. We talk about a wonderful rewards program. Let's be sure that that's the program we're buying into. God's provided the rewards. He's always loyal to us. Let's be loyal to Him and we'll certainly be a part of his wonderful reward program. That's BT Daily. We'll see you next time.